Good social media morning, guys. We are back at it. Let's go. Welcome back, guys. If you missed yesterday's episode, it's because there was no episode. My apologies for that. I was not top of my game yesterday, but I'm back at it today and I'm looking forward to it. If you are new to this, the way that it works is I drop in around five minutes insights on the latest social media updates on your favorite platforms, the great content that's trending and any news that we have about upcoming conferences or events that you need to know about. So. If you are new and you want to get those notifications daily, make sure you hit that subscribe, the bell here on YouTube, and wherever else you are listening to this, go ahead and just hit that subscribe button right now. I'll wait. Let's go. So there's a little known feature over on Twitter. When you've got that favorite TV show that you love to follow, it sends you an update letting you know, hey, guess what? The latest episode is on. There's been a slight update to that. It's not mind altering or mind bending in any way, but at least it's there for you guys. You can roll with it. And for those of you that never want to miss their favorite program when it airs, for those that don't binge watch, I, I don't know who that is, but if you're not one of those that binge watches online and instead you do tune in every week for an episode, uh, mm -hmm. this tool is updated and ready to roll for you. So you love it when your your friends, your acquaintances, your co-workers, they tag you in something on Instagram and you really want that to pop in your story feed, but it's difficult to find and track down, no problem. Instagram's got you covered with their latest update. The way that this is gonna work, guys, is you're gonna hit this little at symbol in your create station. It's gonna let you know, hey, by the way, there's lots of people that are mentioning you here, 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 and here, just in case you wanna throw those up in your story. Hopefully, for those of you on Instagram that have been missing out on a whole bunch of tags, this really helps you guys nail down down, who's talking about you, where, when, why, and how, and you can throw that up in your own Instagram stories. Back to Twitter, guys. We're playing the copycat game on Twitter with this one. Everybody's familiar now with LinkedIn and Facebook, where you can just hold down and give an emoji reaction to something. I like this. I love this. I hate this. This makes me sad. This makes me angry. Great. Well, now you can do that on Twitter, too. Instead of replying with an actual conversation, you are now able to just drop an emoji response to whatever you're throwing out there. Uh, I, for one, am not a huge fan of this. I prefer better when people actually have engagement they throw a gif in there they throw a comment in there but this is there for those that just love to click a button more from Twitter. That's right. Twitter is on top of just changing the system around. They want to look to better build out their Explore page. So Twitter's going to be watching very closely over the next little bit to see how people are using the Explore page and how they can better utilize that to show you content that would be relevant to you, but you may not be on, you may not be aware of. Uh, I think that this is a fantastic way to take that Explore tab feature where instead of it just being a constant flow of what's trending, instead it looks more at who are you following, who are you engaged with, what are the conversations that you're having and let's customize an explore feed for you that isn't just about the trending topics overall but it's more focused on who you're engaging with what you're engaging with and topics that you seem to readily have conversations in i'm excited to see what this does for my feed uh especially since i don't really pop into the explore tab a ton uh this would be definitely incentive for me to go check it out so i can see some new stuff that i maybe am not aware of and last but certainly not least for the day guys social media online sub at 2020 is right around the corner. Uh, it's coming at the start of February. I'm happy to be one of the speakers that's on there. If you guys are not already signed up and ready to go for this, you want to check it out. You want to get in on it for sure. It's online, so you don't have to travel anywhere. You can catch some great speakers, myself, Brian Shulman, Christine Gritmont. There's tons of great people that are going to be speaking at this event. I highly recommend that you head on over to the link that's down below, as are all the links to all of these articles, guys. That's it for today, though. So I hope you have an amazing day, guys. If there's anything that you think I'm missing, think I need to know about, some updates that I maybe have missed on my day off, you just let me know down in the comments below and I'll do my best to cover those, get back into this daily habit. Let's go.